Well, now to an abortion controversy surrounding a Georgia Senate candidate. Pro-life candidate Herschel Walker is accused of paying for his girlfriend's abortion more than a decade ago. Now, he denies this claim, and Republicans are coming to his defense, but not his own son. ABC's Rhiannon Alley has the story. Herschel Walker's son is blasting the growing list of Republicans rallying behind his father. All of this has been a lie and you've known it. Christian Walker posted this video after his father, NFL great Herschel Walker, denied a report that he paid an ex-girlfriend to have an abortion. Family values people, he has four kids, four different women, wasn't in the house raising one of them. As the Senate candidate in Georgia, Walker has called for a total ban on abortion. But according to the Daily Beast, an anonymous woman claims Walker urged her to have an abortion in 2009 and provided receipts for the procedure, along with a $700 check allegedly from Walker to cover the cost. ABC News has not independently verified the allegations. Walker said this when asked about the $700 check. Well, I, I send money to a lot of people, and that's what's so funny. I give money to people all the time because I'm always helping people. The woman also reportedly provide a get well card. The handwritten note reads, pray you are feeling better. Christian Walker says he knows who wrote the note. The abortion card drops yesterday. It's literally his handwriting in the card. Let me hear her show. Georgia's Senate race next month could determine which party controls the U.S. Senate and Republican leaders are coming to Walker's defense. Senator Rick Scott writing, Democrats know they are on the verge of losing the Senate and they know that Herschel Walker is winning, so they have cranked up the smear machine. And Ralph Reed, a prominent conservative activist in Georgia, believes evangelical Christians will stick with Walker. The voters of Georgia are going to reject this kind of gutter politics. Walker acknowledged his son's comments by saying, I love my son no matter what. Rhiannon Alley, ABC News, New York.